Hello again. Here's a, another one I have with again. I call this cage and feel. As I felt the cold hardship of abuse as a child staring at me like a feeling of the first sign of fear and true tale as a child. Looking back with an open question, one why, why? Why am I caged as a child? Why am I was in fear as a child? Why was I being mercifully abused as a child? Mercifully living in fear as a child. Too scared mm -hmm. to come up to anyone. Too scared to play. To be, to be scared to be with anyone. Why is so hard to come out in public? Why am I still living with this beast still beating on me? Still wearing the scars, the ugliness in me. Wearing a mask to hide the ugliness in me, the fear. The tears of a frightened child, caging fear. A lifeline prisoner, a prisoner in fear and torment, living in a childhood hell while being kept in a cage of fear. And doubting myself, doubting everything, still my childhood from me in fear. With hatred, learn to unlearn the fear, unlearn the hatred, and to reclaim my childhood. Taking back my childhood back, taking back the fear of childhood abuse, take back the loneliness, take back the hatred of childhood abuse, staying out of trouble, keep my nose clean, keep my anger in check, keep my hatred in check, be not afraid to take a chance, get back, get myself together, get my life together with hopes, dreams, ideals, and courage and faith, faith in myself and in God. Learn about myself, learn about others, learn about life, learn about forgiveness. Forgives in myself, forgives in others, forgives in others who hurt, hurt and hate me. Learn to survive in a cruel, cruel world. Learn to have faith in myself and others in God. Learning and growing, being with family making friends, making relationships, having courage to make it happen. Praise be to God. Amen. Thank you.